This is how to create a careers or a job board website in Notion. What we'll do is we'll take a Notion page, turn it into a website. Um, it's a no-code website. It will be built in, a, I would say minutes, but it's actually a couple of seconds. Uh, it's free. We've got a generous free plan and fast, optimized, blah, 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 whatever. I'll just jump into it. Step zero is optional. So you might already have a Notion page. Uh, you're looking at it and you say, this is how I want my website to be done, to look like. If you don't have that and you're starting from zero, from ground zero, no need to worry. Just go to this link right here. Um, you will find this in the description of the video. So scroll a bit, click get here. What you do is you scroll until you see the template section, or you can just click this button right here on the left. Notion careers page templates for your website. And uh, what you do is click either of them. And what you want to do is duplicate it. So see this in upper right corner. Let me just zoom in so you can see duplicate, um, put it into, well, put it into your workspace, whatever notion workspace you're using. I think if you have only one, you might not see this, but anyway, let notion do its thing. And this is highly important because you want to have control over the page, over the notion page that we'll be using for your website. Why you'll see this in a second, but spoiler alert, every change you make, on your Notion page will be reflected on the live website. So no need to depend on anyone or you can collaborate with your team. Uh, whatever, I'm getting ahead of myself. I have this page right here. Now this is mine. So um, what are we doing now? Step one, click on share in the upper right corner. So it's in about the same place where Duplicate was a couple of minutes ago. By default, this thing shared to web is disabled. Turn that on. And what you want to do is click copy. Now, this is the public link, the so-called public notion link or URL of your page. And uh, we're already halfway done. So halfway into it. So what you want to do is go anywhere you see. So either here, anywhere you see, paste your notion link here on our website. So either here and I'm, I'll do command V or control V if you're on a windows and click build the website. But it might look like this, it might look like this. So this works just as fine. They both do the exact same thing. We just want to make it super simple for you to build your website from the moment you decide. But I already have a simple, I think, website, sorry, account. Here is uh, where I have all my websites. So um, you can either do this or you can come here and say, add a new website. If you click the blue button here, you'll get to this page. So it's the same thing. Uh, depends on whether you already had an account or not created. Let's see, paste here, I have the page and now I just need to create to, sorry, to select a subdomain for uh, my website. So uh, I can do job board or I don't know, Acme jobs, that's simple at ink. The thing is, what I want to point out is I'll just pick a semi ugly subdomain so that I'll keep the good ones for you guys. Uh, if you want to get Mike, that's simple at ink or uh, Michaela, that's simple at ink, you need to get it first, kind of like any other domain. So highly encourage you to get it now while you can, or just get a good domain while you can. Um, I'll go forward with Acme jobs, one, two, three, just for the sake of letting Acme jobs available for any Acme company down there. Um, that's it. Click, let's launch it. Wait a tiny Okay, don't wait, I guess. And we're here. So the website has been already built. And let me get back to my Notion page right here. Um, as you as you see in a second, the website is one to one with the Notion page right here. So everything you have done in here, which you can edit, I'll show this in a second, will be available, voila, on your simple thing website. So um, let's see what what can we do? Actually, I promised I'll show you the, the changes. So life at Acme, let's change this to our company's culture. And maybe I wanna put Henry, our mascot. Maybe I wanna put them on the left. And did I create, I might have created three columns. Um, let's see, I don't feel, I don't know what I feel like doing today, but yeah, whatever. We're going crazy today. We're, we're just going berserk, small picture, big picture, whatever. If I come back here and I do a refresh, uh, after a couple of seconds, this should be reflected here. There we go. Our company's culture. And we've got Henry as a bigger picture and our lunch 
as a smaller one. So that's it. Every change you make here in a couple of seconds is reflected here. So that's a that's a first step. Um, maybe the last thing I want to show you for the purpose of this video is the fact that if you have a custom domain, um, you are able to add it. So a custom domain would be, um, it doesn't even have to be actually acme.com. It might be jobs.acme.com. So you can use any subdomain you have of your main domain. Um, you would click here, let's add it. Or let me show you the other way because this is this is the homepage of your website. You go on the sidebar, site customization, domain. And um, over here, you can change your .simple .in domain, subdomain. But if you want to add a custom domain, this is a paid feature. So if you want a custom domain, you have to upgrade. If you're not looking to pay us in any way at this very moment or ever really, that's no problem for us. Just stick to your free subdomain. But you will need a paid plan if you want to add your custom domain. And then the instructions are super simple. It takes a couple of minutes. And then instead of Acme jobs, one, two, three, that simple, I think you do jobs.acme.com if you own acme.com and your website will look exactly like this. Uh, you won't have the built on simple, I think badge right here. And um, yeah, this is for the purpose of the video. I'll stop here. This is how to build your job board website in Notion in a couple of seconds, as you've seen um, with Simple Ad Inc. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. I keep monitoring that and um, I'll see you next time.